second game of Stukov now. Infernal Shrines. My teammates are four melee. Zul, Samuro, Artanas and Stitches. And we're against Zul, Stukov, Illidan, Valera, Lucio. Bit of that double support action there. No, I am prepared to go all the way. Yeah. Uh, after this game, we'll try Zul, maybe. The new Zul. Zul just got reworked. I am the great sage, equal of heaven. This oh, that's a lot better. Oh, that's a raptor. That's nice. The battle begins in ten seconds. Move quickly. Five, four, three, two, uh, one. We'll go for the weighted pustule belt. Begin. This one is slow and damage in an area upon detonation. This one is short cooldown. Let's go for the area. Popping postures. Detonate 10 weighted postures without dying. Which takes a minimum of 2.5 minutes, 160 seconds. Moving out. Very slow attack speed, very high damage. How does Hearthstoning look like with him? I'm returning to base. Cool. There will be no end to your suffering. Oh yeah, the weighted pustule can both spread and cleave. First blood. So it's much easier to stack. Impacts all enemy heroes in its path. No, it doesn't say that it can spread. It's just that you can hit multiple people. And it's a 70% slow. Valera's here, right? The only fair thing is to take vigorous uptake as this is automatically completed as a bug right now on PTR so I'll just take that one so I don't have like overly much damage. Yeah, even without the bug, just completing it seems very strong, but who knows how long it takes, right? Oh, 
Uh, the bug is that the reward for vigorous uptake has been embedded baseline into the trade by accident. At least it doesn't deal that much damage, the uh, E. Detonating exactly one. No, let's do the range. Huh? Actually, I don't need to. I get CDR for lurking arm. Man, <laughs> that seventy percent slow seems really strong. Lurking arm cooldown. How well can I take camps? Probably not too well. Not worth to cast E. Auto attack is better. It's not too bad with auto attacks. Not ideal, but it's it's okay. I'm gonna go get some mana, and I'm gonna go top. Yeah, he does. 373 per auto, but he only attacks twice in every three seconds. Which is the slowest auto attack in the game. This time I'll try flailing swipe. Game one I just tried massive show. Finish them off with the uh, no, not with. It's still active. So I got the level one quest, which is slow and damage in an area. Oh. <laughs> Of course, it's very bad to miss his auto attacks, which is too tough. Yes. 
The heal is sick. Of course, this is with the quest reward that I shouldn't have yet, but will soon. Yeah, that's a really nice boss steal mechanic, but flailing swipe. It's going to be hard to use effectively. seen this effect activate yet have you guys seen it yeah he has short cooldown I upgraded it though how's my impression on Stukov just started watching very powerful very powerful and fun Not too mana intensive, but mana is a factor, obviously. Victory is ours. We have summoned a mortal punisher. Our fort is lost. Zul soloing a fort top. Switch no longer removes healing pathogen, increased ways to cost shield damage. Yep, and blind. Two thirty-four. Hey, didn't I? The final damage of way to cost shield. Huh? It's updated. Two thirty-four. No, is it?
I recommend you to buy him. MVP. Hundred K. Hundred K heal. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> he interrupted his own charge again. <laughs> Excellent. I mean, he shouldn't charge from the edge, I guess, but still. <laughs> 